Global News has uncovered a third instance of racially charged images of liberal leader Justin Trudeau. Let's bring in our Ottawa Bureau Chief Mercedes Stevenson. She has broken this story. She joins us now from Vancouver with the exclusive details. Good morning. Good morning. A video uncovered by Global News, which has been verified by the Liberal War Room, as in fact containing images of Liberal leader Justin Trudeau in blackface makeup. The Liberals have declined to tell us exactly when and where this video was taken, but you can have a look. It's pretty grainy. Uh, we wanted to be very sure that this was in fact the Liberal leader before we made the video public. They did confirm to us last night that we are looking at Justin Trudeau in this video. You can see that he has blackface makeup on. It's covering his face, neck, his arms and hands, and you can see between the tears in his jeans there that he also appears to have the makeup down his legs as well. This, as you mentioned, is the third image of him within about 12 hours that has come out uh, and uh, initially broken by Time magazine. I can tell you that Global News obtained this video and has been trying to verify it for a couple of days. We approached the Liberal War Room with it last night uh, after that news broke from Time magazine to ask if this was in fact him. Uh, obviously such a stunning video that we we wanted to be absolutely sure, but they do say, yes, this is Justin Trudeau in the video. Uh, they referred to his previous apologies on wearing blackface makeup and brownface makeup as being inappropriate. They've not issued an additional apology for this video at this time. It's interesting because the Liberal leader was asked last night whether he had ever appeared in brown or blackface before after that uh, Time News story broke. And what he said was that he had done it once before in high school. This is not the high school incident. We have verified this is a separate incident. So this is now a third time that the Liberal leader has been seen in blackface or brownface. Uh, and as you can imagine, this is extremely politically charged given the history of blackface and brownface makeup, the race stereotypes that it has been used to perpetrate, uh, and certainly the Liberal leader's position on being progressive and inclusive. So we are waiting to hear reaction, of course, today on the campaign trail from all of the parties. But again, this is the third incident that we have seen, and it is a separate incident than the two that were reported previously and one that the Liberal leader did not reveal last night when he was asked about this. Now, Mercedes, one incident can be career-ending for any candidate. Now we have three incidents. Is there any estimate to the political damage to this and how he could recover? Well, that's a great question. I mean, we'll have to say uh, how the campaign handles it and how this rolls out and how people react. But as you say, one incident is bad enough. And in the United States, it certainly has ended politicians' careers. Uh, Justin Trudeau has a history of progressive policies, appointing people to cabinet where he's demonstrated that uh, he is trying to be diverse. What happens now that videos like this come out? Uh, you know, the, the incident in high school, he was in high school. The incident here, he is not in high school. And the other incident, he was a teacher. So you're now looking at three separate incidents. That becomes much harder to explain three separate occasions than one. And on this occasion, he does not appear to be in a play or at a costume party. It's hard to know what he was doing here since the Liberal campaign uh, has not shared that with us. We certainly are trying to get that information. We have information from the source who shared the video, but we are waiting to verify that before we report it. You can see he appears to be outside somewhere rural. Uh, and previously in the video, you see people walking by in life jackets, like they've been in boats. Uh, so we're trying to find out exactly what was happening here and why he was in blackface, although there really is no politically acceptable answer for that in 2019. So it's certainly going to be a difficult day for the Liberal leader now that he has to explain not one incident, but three that have become public.